second honeymoon, Tom and I decide to take a road trip on the bus. We're going to Key Largo, and I've never been to any of the Keys. Hello, old friend. Get you out on the road today. Before I met Lily, the bus was a huge part of my life, and I feel like it's something that I'm not ready to give up. I do hope that this weekend away helps solidify our decision and just brings us closer together. At this point, I need all the help I can get to make the right decision. I'm not touching that. No, I got it. Where can I put, like, Zeus's food and stuff? Um, we can put it uh, down here in the bottom. Some room there, some right there. I'm gonna go hook up the batteries and disconnect the shoreline. Okay. All right. So what you doing there? I'm just hooking up the batteries. Make sure there's no cats sleeping in the engine room. Kitties, gotta go. Raccoons, time to get out, let's go. Dr. Pepper says that for this trip, limited electronics, if possible, none. That is, oh, that's so hard for me. My work is based off my phone and my laptop. I mean, I mean, that's my life. I get hives even thinking about it. All right. Are we ready now? I'm loose. Oh my gosh. Lily and I definitely have two different lifestyles. Oh, the spice rack opened. Oh, did it? Go ahead and close it. That other window in the back doesn't open? That's OK. The other on the other side is. It's all right. I don't want to say that Lily's high maintenance, but she is a little bit prissy. And she definitely tends to complain about little things. Are you almost ready? Yep. The bus is on. Run. I didn't know it took that much work to move a bus from an RV park. I'm like, there's connections, you have to move, you batteries, you have to connect, you have to do so much to it. I was like, oh my God, this takes forever. Ready? <gasps> it's snowing. I got some foam stuck up in there. I forgot to vacuum out the vents. I am in love with Tom. But even though we have such a big connection, in one week, I have to make a very big decision for my marriage. Tom and I have completely different lifestyles. And I'm trying to figure out which is more important for Tom, the marriage or the lifestyle. I don't feel like you're a stranger. I know, right? I never pictured getting married to a stranger. You may kiss your bride. 